Hello there, Ace of the Zodiac, and we're back with a taste of a game that we're going to have today. Uh, today we're doing Moonlighter, which looks interesting, so let's check it out. It's not done ex- Ugh, son of a- Okay, there we go. Moonlighter begins. Let's see how this goes. Moonlighter is an interesting game where you are a, a storekeeper who goes on adventures to fill his store or something. I don't know all the specifics. Ah, I love it. Hmm, that's a bit loud. It might interfere with the recording. I have to adjust that, maybe. Let's try out Moonlighter. Right, save spot. Hmm. It's never good when you see a game recommend that you play hard mode. Let's give it a shot, though. If you can't tell, this is also a mystery dungeon game. Right, Noka. Heroes and Merchant. Glory and Riches. Will of Moonlighter. What a weird name for a thing. Also, Mystery Fifth Door. Dun dun dun. This game looks really interesting. And there we got a little tutorial showing us how to move and stuff. None of the buttons work so far. Oh, that, that button works. Yay, rolling. Rolling is fun. That's match. None of the buttons work yet. Yeah. Guess we just go on. Oh, and it's telling us how to roll. We can roll over gaps. Where have we seen this before? And, uh, roll behind obstacles that I think is an enemy. I'm not sure. Roll through bullets. And, uh, oh, we have a... It's telling us to... Oh, we can attack now. We got a room. Broom spear. Uh oh, we got little little sign boys. And I guess R2 is to use healing potions or something that we have. That is my guess. Hmm, chest. Can't open it. Oh, there's a, a lizard thing. I think that's a lizard anyway. Looks kind of mossy. Oh, and it died. It let us open the chest. We have uh, some vines, some roots, some rich jelly. And this has a water lamp. Uh... Fascinating. Gold runes. And the fabric. 
I don't need to look at any of this stuff because I have a, I have a feeling I understand most of it. It's items that help you adventure and also help you uh, kill stuff. Oh, we can do a charge attack. Neat. Oh, another chest. Broken sword. An ancient pot. Oh. There we go. Still getting used to how this game works. Uh, oh, oh dear. Oh dear. I lost track of myself there. Hmm. I take it this is where we're supposed to die. Because, yeah. These enemies, uh, don't seem killable. Yep, yeah, there we go. I died. Yep. Yeah, it's not been my day when it comes to playing games where you're allowed to win. Thank you, thank you, nerds, for continuing to do this for time immemorial. We now have a shortened seal. We now have a short words. That is, that is a game. Cannot leave the game yet. Oh nice, the mirror works. I want to save my game and leave. I guess it will not let me yet. I must then know the item's value as well as its demand. Makes sense. And I guess we're being coerced into, uh... I'm pressing the button, but... Let me do the thing. Oh, we... That's unintuitive. I guess it's time for capitalism. This is probably the real meat and potatoes of the game. Selling stuff. Capitalism ho!
Hmm, he doesn't want it. Buy that one. Basic economics. And now we can look at all of our cool stuff. They like it at a at hundred. Interesting. Well, that was fun. And how do I... Oh, didn't mean to break all those. How do I make the game stop? Okay, we can stop now. Okay, uh, that was fun. It probably could explain some of its mechanics a bit better, because I'm not sure how to switch my weapon, or even if I can. I mean, I know I can, obviously, but it, you know what I mean. Anyway, it definitely has a lot of style, and I like the look of it. So, uh, hope you all enjoyed. We'll see you guys next time. Take care.